When Columbus City School students head back to class this fall, they're going to see some new faces, including 50% more security staff. Thanks for joining us tonight at 5. I'm Mark Taylor. And I'm Darlene Hill. The district says it will hire nearly three dozen officers to make sure that students feel safe. NBC4's Ted Hart is live tonight at Whetstone High School with more on the district's new plan and what it means for students here. Ted? Yeah, under the new plan, most of the high schools will have a couple of school security staff members in addition to a Columbus Police School resource officer. All of the middle schools will have security staff, as will some of the elementary schools. And the hope is that these new staff members will be able to build relationships with students as well as keep the buildings secure. So this is our base operations office. This was the superintendent's first visit to the district's nerve center for safety and security. I have over 5,000 cameras in the district um, and growing. Um, and what we try to do is just try to keep an eye on, be that extra set of eyes and ears for um, our security staff, building administrators, um, school staff. Director Chris Ward made the case to significantly increase the size of the district's safety and security staff. The superintendent said it was a matter of setting priorities. Safety is important for our students and our staff and our parents. They want our students to come to a safe school with people they can build relationships with. Um, and I believe this is going to um, provide that for us. Dr. Dixon said seven of the new positions had been promised through a levy. The others, though, are the result of data compiled on incidents per school, as well as looking at crime in the neighborhoods around the schools and other factors. And Chris Ward says safety and security staff do much more than just secure the buildings and talk about do's and don'ts. They are also mentors and coaches. That is what's so important. Our young people are looking for adults to, to help them uh, through their development. And that's what um, the 31 additional staff will do. And the number of Columbus Police School Resource Officers will remain at 19 next year, but there will be three additional truancy officers. Local for you and live on the north side, Ted Hart, NBC4. All right, Ted, thank you.